Cradle Crew. I hope everyone is having an amazing week. Just wanted to share with you this beautiful, peaceful spot I found while hiking in the mountains. I decided to stop and take a rest and even go for a swim. It wasn't completely peaceful. We did get chased at the end by a bear. Yeah, you heard it, a bear. And so stay tuned to the end of this video to see that part of the clip. Now on to the nursery to visit with the babies first. I'll see you at the end. Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Welcome back to the cradle and welcome if you are new here. I hope my cradle crew is doing well this week. I'm back from vacation and getting going in the nursery again. And I'm here with baby Levi, who is available on my website, still looking for his family. He needs a new mommy or daddy. So go check him out if you're looking for a Levi by Bonnie Brown. But baby Peaches, she has a new mommy. Auntie Teresa snagged this little girl up. While I was on my way up to the mountains, she bought this little baby and has been super patient for me to return home so that I can get her packed up and sent home to her new mama. Congratulations. I'm gonna run to the store real quick, you guys, and go buy this baby a few things for her box opening, along with other things that I need for some baby box openings. So follow along with me today while I do a little shopping and do a little haul for you guys. I hope you enjoy this video. This is so sweet. Oh, still way too big a size. These were smaller. Totally buy them. So cute. Oh, That's what I'm looking for. I'm trying to find the size I need for Little Miss Peach. I think we're, once again, way too big. That stinks. Oh, maybe? No, 24 months. Darn it. I may have to send her home with this cute little outfit. Or maybe I can find something with peaches on it. I can find something kind of peachy would be cute for her. Pineapples, not peaches. I was hoping for something kind of peachy. Let me see what I can find. Oh, it's cute. Anything with peaches on it, that would be so sweet. Oh, everything is so big here. I don't know what is going on. Everything is way too big. Oh, wait, wait, wait. These have, are these peaches? So kind of like oranges, but I can't tell. Are they peaches or oranges? Still way too big. Why is everything running so stinking big here? Ugh. It's making me crazy. That's kind of cute. I don't know what this is or where it came from, but it's super cute too. Let me work on finding her some peach stuff. Oh, that's cute. Oh, let's send her home in that. That's super cute and peachy. So cute. Let me see what else I can find for her. Ooh, I hear a storm coming. I don't like that one as much. Cherries. Cherries. Oh my goodness. Some of these things are so cute. Like 
Oh, look at these. Oh, so pretty. I cannot even decide. How cute. Oh, I love this. Mommy loves me. This little outfit is so cute. Look at this. So cute with the little pants. That is adorable. I cannot even decide. Look at how cute is this. Oh my gosh, it's adorable. It has a little matching pants. Look at this. Oh my gosh. So cute. Look at the little matching socks. Oh my gosh. And I saw this one last time I was here. It is so adorable. I love these colors. Guys, <laughs> oh, I'm at Walmart in a little like baby toy section. And these babies are so freaking adorable. Like, I want to get one of these babies for my babies. <laughs> so glad that I bought lots of the little sassy unicorns because I can't find them anymore. They're like no longer here. Oh, now we have a, a Jack the Giraffe. Not the same. <gasps> Avocado! So cute! and the watermelon. I'm dying with this watermelon one. Oh my goodness. I wish it was like popsicles and watermelon. I would totally buy it. But I would not recommend these for an 18 month old. Look at how tiny those little um, handles are. Looks like they could just break them right off or chew them off with their teeth. Choke on them. But for reborns, it's so cute. I want the ice cream and the watermelon. The problem with these is I like one and not the other <laughs> in each one. Ugh. That's frustrating, but really cute. All right, guys. So I'm home with a little haul and I found some really cute stuff at the store. So some stuff is gonna go home with Baby Peaches. I have a little theme going on for her. And I also want to show you this cute little diaper. I have been falling in love with Thirsty's diapers. I have finally found a cloth diaper that I really love. This one is going to be for baby Nathan. He now has two cloth diapers that I can change him in and out of. And his soon-to-be sister, who will be home very shortly, um, my silicone baby girl is done being painted and matted by her artist and she's just growing some hair and then she'll be home for a box opening coming up guys so stay tuned but I have two diapers for her and two little diapers for Nathan and I fell in love with these because as you know I was up in the mountains and these have mountains and trees on them and a little moon it's so cute absolutely love this this is very special, and I will talk about this later. Um, special mommy there. Um, so let's get into a little haul that I have here. 
So my theme for the peaches kit is of course peaches. And I've been looking all over for peach stuff for my baby peaches, but I only have one peach outfit for her that was sent in by an auntie um, for a different baby last year, but I'm gonna put it on her because I think it will fit. But this little peaches that's going home, I was trying to find peach stuff for her. I know that they have peach stuff at Target, but our Target is pretty far away. So I had to go to Walmart and I was able to find peach colored stuff, but nothing with like peaches on it. So that's okay though. This is really cute. This is very soft. So I'm gonna send her home with this little blanket that I got for her. I also found this cute little lovey that is really beautiful. This matches. Super sweet, absolutely love this little lovey. And I'm gonna kind of dip into the clothes here. I found these cute little sandals for her. Are these not the sweetest little sandals for summer? So cute. I think I wanna send her home in this peach colored Carter's pajama outfit. It has a cute little koala bear on it. I think it's adorable. I love the color, super beautiful. So nice for the summer. This, these colors can also go well for the fall. I found this cute little outfit in zero to three months. It will have to be washed. It's cotton, so it'll be really big on her if you don't wash it. So it comes with a little headband. It comes with this little dress that's kind of like a onesie combo and this little sweater. So I thought this would be so cute to pair up with these little sandals here and hopefully um, mama will like that. I also found two headbands, one that can go with her little outfit and the other one could go with her little pajama outfit that she'll be in. So I think that's really cute. Then I got a bunch of stuff that I needed for my babies. My girls all are going to be wearing like zero to three month size clothes and I needed some onesies so I got these cute little onesies. It's like a three pack and look at those little flowers. How pretty is that? These are beautiful. This is one of my favorite ones and I might be sending this home possibly under um, baby peaches outfit because I have a onesie like this already I believe uh, that was sent home with another baby so I'll probably put it under her little outfit I'm not sure I got these little um, honest bodysuits they're 100% organic cotton if I can find one that matches in there which I'm sure I can because they're all different colors um, how cute are those I found these before I left on my trip and it's like a pack of 10 um, newborn sized oh see those are newborn they won't fit her so I will use that onesie but these are newborn sized so super cute um, little body suits uh, I think that I showed those in a video that might have gotten uh, deleted on YouTube I don't know what happened to the video I can't find it anywhere but um, I'll also show you something else I got in the mail that was really cute um, that I think got cut out of those videos. I don't know. Once I upload to YouTube, I usually delete my videos and YouTube really messed up a video while I was on my trip. But I found these cute little uh, pacifiers. It has like the owl and the deer on it. I love anything that's like woodland creature stuff. Uh, Parents' Choice is stepping it up a little bit. So I found these cute pacifiers, possibly for babies that are going home. Um, I may end up using uh, this little dinosaur one for little baby Noah because he has a cute dinosaur outfit that that would go with. And then this one is Unicorn and Rainbows. Absolutely love both of these little pacifiers. So cute. And I've been looking for these for a long time. I kept passing these up in certain stores and regretting it because I think these look so cute on Rylan. And I love the little bear and the paw prints. And 
I finally found these again. They are six to 18 months, but he's a big kit, so he can handle that. And then I love sending these home with my babies. They like rattle and you can hang them on like a crib or you can hang these from the stroller or the car seat. I think they're so cute. There's a little elephant one here. I absolutely love the crinkly ears. And I got another owl, so super cute. So along with these little honest body suits that was like, it's called rainbows and I found it on Amazon if you need onesies for your babies. They come in all different sizes and I love all these different colors. You can use them for boy babies, girl babies. They're very gender neutral, which I love. But in the mail, I also got these um, cloth diapers, these thirsty diapers I get on Amazon. I'm a huge Amazon shopper, guys. So if you don't have an Amazon account, you should get one because I can find anything on there. But I also found this cute little lovey by Nookums and it has a little pacifier. And remember how I said I have baby girl coming? This might go with her because she can take a full pacifier. She's a full body silicone and she's a bigger baby girl. So I think she'll be able to take this just fine. I think that'll be really cute for her. And I needed some different colored tissue paper for box openings. And this has like 360 sheets and 36 different colors and designs. So I thought this would be super fun for box openings to send home with some of this stuff. So hopefully you enjoyed this little haul. I'm already getting in gear. It's my first day home and technically I don't start back in the nursery till tomorrow because we came home a little early, but I thought it would be fun to go out and do some shopping and kind of get started with some fun stuff in the nursery before the week begins. I am so happy to be home and back in the nursery. I actually missed all these little sweet baby faces while I was gone on my trip. Do you guys go on a trip or go out of town or leave for the weekend and leave your babies behind at home and then start to miss them? I know I do. If you guys miss your babies when you go out of town, leave a comment down below. I wanna know I'm not crazy. I really did miss these sweet little smiling faces. And I came home really late last night and didn't get into the nursery until the early morning hours this morning. And I have to say, my heart just like swelled when I saw all these little faces. I miss these guys so, so, so much. I hope you guys enjoyed this cute little video. I have several videos planned for this week, so be on the lookout for those. I have some babies coming home. One is a very happy and very much anticipated uh, delivery. And then another one is a bit of a sad story. We'll see if that one makes it home to me or not, but I will get into that story later. I will see you guys on the next video. Take care of yourselves, take care of each other and those beautiful, sweet little precious babies. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye guys. So this is baby bear and we are scrambling to our car to avoid mama bear. The little baby's by itself, honey. I don't know where mama is. That looks like a mama bear. You think so? Is this mommy? Looks like it's a much bigger bear.